We will be reviewing the basic techniques for applying old age makeup for the stage. Wear a shirt that either buttons or zips so you won't mess up your makeup if you remove clothing. First, cleanse and moisturize your face, then apply foundation. You may need to mix different colors together to match your skin correctly. Next, begin the contouring for old age. Always start lighter and make it darker if you need to. Less is more. Start with the basic shadow areas, the temple, the cheek, and the nose. Then also add shadow to the inner corner of the eye and the nostrils. As always, make sure to blend so there are no discernible lines. You may then add lines to the forehead, outer corner of the eye, frown lines by your eyebrows, smile lines, and your lips to make wrinkles. You may also want to add jowls to help give your jaw the appearance of sinking. Next, put the highlight above all of your shadows. Always blend so there are no discernible markings for where the shadow and highlight begin or end. Once your basic contouring is applied, use a stipple sponge to apply color. Adding a stippling of yellow will help make the skin look more sallow, while adding red will help give the impression of broken capillaries. This is the basic old age look. Now we will enhance everything to make it an even older look. Depending on your costume, you can also extend your contouring down to the neck, but make sure you don't put it too far down the neck or it will rub off on your costume. To give an older appearance, simply deepen all your shadows and highlights and add more stipple. You may also want to deepen and add more wrinkles.
Once you've finished your makeup, be sure to powder to seal the work onto your face. Load the powder puff with powder and press the puff to your face. If you need to see an example of powder application, please watch one of the basic makeup videos. This has been the basic techniques for applying old age makeup for the stage.